G'day Smoke and Dagger fans, let's talk barbecue. A new addition to the fleet, we've got the Weber Smokefire EX6. Just look at this beauty. Let's talk some features. At the front of the barbecue here, nice aesthetic look, love that. But let's open her up and see what's inside. Look at this, look at all that space for grilling, two tiers. And if we come a little bit closer, have a look at this. What we can see here is the removable gourmet barbecue system. So you might've seen this on other Weber products, including the Master Touch. So this bad boy here, it can come out and you can replace it with any number of accessories. I'm talking sear, pizza stone, Dutch oven. It doesn't matter, the possibilities are limitless. So you'll see underneath the grates here, we have our flavorizer bars. And if you look a little bit deeper into the chamber, you might actually see where the flames come from. The source of the heat is directly underneath the food, which enables you to get that really nice hot searing temperature. So this is generation two smoke fire. So a lot of the bad feedback for the gen one came to do a lot with fat fires. So they've completely redesigned how it captures grease. And as you can see here, we've got a nice removable fat tray. Everything goes in there, super easy to clean. Let's talk hopper. This bad boy here holds approximately nine kilos. When you're doing low and slow, Weber claims that's a 15 hour cook. Or if you're doing hot and fast, approximately six hours of cook time. We can see this lovely digital display. Easy menu navigation with this dial and the three buttons here. That's also how you access. <laughs> That's where the temperature drops right down. Pellet Grill puts out some fantastic smoke for that authentic smoked barbecue feel, but with all the convenience of an electric pellet grill. It's got a couple of competitors, so mainly the Traeger and the GMG, but I honestly think for the build quality Weber provides and the price point, it's gonna be hard to beat. This thing's an absolute beast, performance is fantastic. So the main downside, if any, of buying this lovely unit here, it's gotta be priced. For the same price as this, I probably could have bought another three Weber Smoky Mountains. However, I think this is a fantastic barbecue if you're short in time. If you've got the money to spend, I strongly encourage you to go have a look at one. I'm really happy with it. It complements the barbecue fleet nicely.